In this video, I will shoot the world's largest trigger fish with my T-Bar spear gun. <laughs> Obviously, I'm lying. That day, I was looking for uh, yellowtails. I shot a 32-pounder uh, the day before. But since the yellowtails are a fish that you can't really count on to show up, I fish for barred pargos, which is my favorite you know, fish to shoot. And here they are. You can see a whole school. But those guys, they will not get close to you, my friends. This is a two-minute-plus dive that I'm doing right now. At uh, This was 15.6 meters, I remember, on the watch. Eventually, one of them, like, when, you know, you stay down there another 40 seconds, you know, that's when they risk approaching, like, almost shaft length. Anyway, see the length of that shot. I shot it in the belly, but it was a good shot. Not a big fish, but I was so happy. So, the cabrillas were all over the place, and I had seen a 20-pounder. But look at this guy. Look at look how far I have to shoot so I do this lunge, lunge, and, uh, you know, I make it. But I didn't shoot it very well, as you're going to see. Man, you have to be patient when you see this. Uh, you, you can land just about anything if you have patience and uh, a little faith. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, no, 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 no. Uh, you know, it's a, it's their skill there. There's skill. Look at that. I got it. I got it. That's a nice cabrilla. Yep. Very nice fish. Good to eat. Look at this turtle. <laughs> Look at the size of that tail. It's just ridiculous. That prehistoric monster, whatever. I'm at 26 meters. The visibility looks great, but that's because it was good at that depth. And I have the sun behind me. I'm, I'm looking for cabrillas. I'd seen a 20-pounder just before that. But then this trigger fish looks pretty big. And it's coming towards me until it's not. And I make the shot. I I am certain that I did not make this shot. But guess what? Impaled it from the tail all the way to the head. Amazing shot it turns out. I guess my reflexes were good that day. <laughs> So, uh, look at this slow-mo. You can see how the shaft just, this is reduced speed, you know, twice. It's like half the speed. And you see the shaft going right in his ass. On the beach, this fish weighed 19 pounds. But when I got home after an hour and a half of transport and shaking around and the heat and everything, it, it, it measured, uh, it weighed 18.5. Uh, not that it matters much. Uh, there's, <laughs> there's just no, no way I'll go through the process of getting it uh, recognized. Anyway, the, who cares? This was a really nice fish and my best trigger fish uh, ever.